I'm really excited to be announcing the opening of the Esports High Performance Centre at Eden Park. We feel these facilities are a great hub to build projects around, not just for our for our own teams and projects, but for the, um, the industry more broadly. It's going to be a community facility, which will hopefully bring together a, a number of players at the grassroots level, and then overlaying that, we'll uh, be looking to have some professional programs as well. Our philosophy of placing esports facilities in traditional sports infrastructure is... Um, is something we've applied in, in multiple regions. It really is a win-win situation. I feel like we bring a, a younger demographic to, to some of these uh, traditional sports venues and really step into that digital world. These facilities have amazing space that's only used a, a few times a year sometimes but for some of the big sporting events. They're fantastic internet for traditional sports broadcasts, provide amazing IT infrastructure. And just more broadly, the, the gyms, the, the personal trainers, that, that, that degree of professionalism does permeate through, through all the programs that, that are run there. Really exciting time for Guinevere and um, hopefully really exciting time for, for New Zealand esports as well. Eden Park, New Zealand's national stadium, is iconic and at the centre are many special moments for both Kiwis and tourists around the globe. The emergence of esports highlights the need for stadium diversification and further developing the fan experience. The Esports High Performance Centre will showcase Eden Park's ability to evolve, diversify and be at the forefront of technology. It will attract new audiences who may have never attended a rugby, football or cricket match at Eden Park, whilst delivering significant economic benefit. Auckland's unprecedented growth in recent years demonstrates the city's global appeal and diverse communities.